years, remember? Wherever you go, I go. <laughs> Gordy. How did he get invited to a party? He's like 50. So what are we doing here? Doesn't look like an old folks home. come to see Gordy Kramer. Kramer? The big wig tycoon from Kramer Construction? No, his son. His son. Think maybe he's the origami Dumbass. killer. For now, I just have a few questions that need answers. Look at this swanky place. They have dog statues. Why would anyone invite Scott Shelby here? He's a lame-ass private investigator. An old lame-ass private investigator. Okay. What a joint! Kramer must be loaded. What do you think he paid for all this shiny crap? We'll discuss Kramer's decor another time. Whoa. Are we going to be here long? What kind of a party is this? Creeps. I'm going to go find Gordy Kramer. Chicks you stay here till down I come down back. And okay? Okay. Well. Just let me know if you need me. That guy's me. passed out. Oh my god. She looks like she's dead. That guy's passed out on a pool table. No one wants to talk to me? Okay. I think you guys are snobs anyway. What the fuck? Ever heard of a bed, dumbass? Pool. Hey, how do you too? <gasps> Ladies dancing. Gordy. I'm looking for Gordy. Have you seen him? Fuck you. Nice sweater. Did mom get it for you, asshole? Hi. I like your dancing. Wanna go kiss? Oh, I'll sit down and watch. You deserve it. Approach. You come here often? Oh, come on. That's the best you can fucking do. Great party, huh? Ugh, great party, huh? You come here often? What a fucking creep. Yeah. She's right to friends. live. To leave. It's also right to live, though. I'm not here to stop her from living. Gordy. Press X to Gordy. Have Gordy! Gordy! Sorry, no! Oh, at least you're nice. X to whiskey. Whiskey! Whiskey straight up, no ice. Yeah. What a boss. Open bar? This Gordy got. He he knows how to entertain. Half naked ladies. I want another. Okay. Any what's this? Cakes? Oh. Awesome. Hey man, do you think you could help me out? Do I look like a dealer? Get out of here! Well, why else would an old guy be at a party like this if he wasn't dealing? But the poor stoner Hi. picked Great the wrong party, guy huh? to ask. This guy's wasted. I haven't seen you. Well, let's get better acquainted, pal. That looks like a bottle of rubbing alcohol. Oh, you're my kind of guy. I like <laughs> you. <laughs> my friend. I, I like you. Maybe my friend. Now I got me a new friend. I like you. What a freak. Okay, seems like we've talked to everyone we can, so Gordy. Hi, I'm looking for Gordy. You know where he is? I saw him a while back, but you'll be lucky to see him. He rarely hangs out down here with his guests. Oh really? Why bother throwing a party then? Why don't you go ask him? Okay, random girl, we'll do. I could just go upstairs. You Excuse shall not me. pass. Nobody allowed upstairs. 
aggressive. Look, Cinder fella. <laughs> the clock's just turned 12 Cinder and I don't want to have to turn you into a pumpkin. You're real smart, fella. Bet you won't be so funny with my foot up your ass. Thinks he's a red foreman or something? If I want to see Gordy Kramer, I'm going to have to go about it some other way. Cinder fella. That's, that's pretty good. Oh, look, people making out right next to Lauren. So, did you find Gordy? He's upstairs. We got two goons blocking the way. Do you want me to handle them? Yeah. <laughs> You're the best. Hey, what are you going to do? Knock them out with a pair of high heels? You're funny, Scott. Leave it to me. Send your fella, Be but ready to go as soon as terrible. they leave the stairs. Wait, Lord. No, he's trying to be a sexy lady. That guy's like, hell yeah. And, oh, and his friend's a cock block. One thing I don't understand is why both of them have to go help her. There are plenty of other guests that can help, or just one of them can go help. It's really... But she did the job. Miss. She Miss, got us upstairs. Right? And for that, I thank you, Lauren. Shit. Another one's gonna OD on the dance floor. Okay, cool. So, we're up here now. Uh... Is it these doors? Ooh, <laughs> girls are making out. Interesting. <laughs> Mr. Kramer. Shh, this is the best part. <laughs> this guy's watching a cartoon. My name is Scott Shelby. Giggling. I'm a private detective. Which obviously I'm means he's baked. The case of the origami killer. I'd like to ask you a few questions. <laughs> he's ignoring us, so he's a dick, too. Turn off the TV. Scott, it's not even funny. Turn off the TV. It's a chicken running. Persistent. I'd like to know Ew. exactly what happened to little Joseph Brown. Beat it. You hear me? Get the hell out of here! Oh, I like them. You dick. What do you want? Factual. A witness saw little Always Joseph best to go with the facts. In the back of your limousine. That was the last time anybody ever saw it. Now, I know you've been arrested and interrogated until your father made a little phone call and the file was closed. I'd like to hear Ew. your version of the facts. See how he looked? The kid was lost. He was I holding back a sneezer. To drive him home. The police arrived. I explained the misunderstanding and I was released. End of story. Nothing to get excited about, right? Sarcastic. Yeah, okay, right, so you you're fucking idiot. That wasn't really sarcastic, it was just rude. Limousine. I'll be a nice guy and tell me something I can't believe. Very well. I'm the origami killer. See, he says origami. The fuck? I get my victims into my car. I drown them in rainwater. Then I dump them on a wasteland with an origami figure in one hand and an orchid on the chest. I do that because I'm bored, Mr. Shelby. And it's a creative and entertaining way of Having fun. Is that good enough for you? Or do you want more? This interview is over. Get rid of this clown! 
Oh, shit, it's you guys. Oh! Oh, no. Oh. Oh, man. Oops. Didn't avoid that one. Got hit right in the kisser. Right in the dick. Nope. Not today, bald guy. Oh, oh. Ah! Nice. No, you're not shooting anyone today, bald guy. Or your friend, hair guy. What the fuck are you smiling about? It's a dangerous game you're playing, Kramer. Do you know who my father is? He only has to lift one finger and you won't wake up tomorrow morning. Cool. You're the one that should be afraid, Mr. Shelby. Not me. You think you're so cool. Because you're watching a stupid cartoon and you have a statue with a penis. You're not cool, though. Your guards broke your table. And I hope the new one you get is wobbly. <laughs> yeah, laugh it up, asshole. Is that it? Yeah, okay. So, uh, I'm gonna stop here. Next time, next Monday, we'll be playing as Ethan. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, or really any of the videos I've done so far, be sure to check out my channel. Uh, be sure to subscribe to the Director's Hub and check us out on Facebook. Ooh, trophy. And, uh, Twitter. And all of the links will be in the description. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.